morning everyone, how are we all? Welcome back to a little day in the life of wee me. Um, please excuse the absolute state of me, I was wearing like this tan remover stuff last night so I put on my tan house coat just because it stains everything. But yeah, I've not long woke up, I have stripped to bed in case you're thinking do I not own bed sheets? I actually do. I have just stripped to bed um, and I'm going to go to the gym and then when I come back we're going to take the dogs a walk and we're going to get a wee food shop. I've got a big food shop because there's no food in the house and literally yesterday I ate so much shite because there wasn't any food in the house and I'm annoyed at myself. But this video is sponsored by Cubella. Um, I have worked with this brand before. I'll pop up their Instagram here for you guys. Um, I literally have so many of their face masks in my fridge. Like, people must be like, oh, she is really has a real crackpot. Um, Lee's absolutely buzzing because I was sitting here and I was like, oh, mind those face masks. And he was like, yeah, I was like, oh, they've sent me new ones. And he was like, oh, football's on and I can't wait to wear my... He thinks he's getting a face mask while he's watching football. So I am going to do that for him. Um, so this is my little box of stuff. I actually keep this box for the ones. So what I tend to do is the ones I think I'm going to wear, I put them in the fridge and try and keep them in the fridge for a good day before using them. Um, so where was this one I want to use? Now, I'm obsessed with avocado. I just love avocado, love guacamole, I love anything that avocado is in. And look at this one. Excuse the nails. I don't know why, but it just seems stunning. So, pardon me, this one is Cooling Avocado Clay Mask Enriched with Avocado Oil, Shea Butter and Cocoa Butter. I am sorry, but the minute you use anything that contains Shea Butter, you are stunning. You're soft. You're absolutely banging. So I think I'm going to use this one. Um, so I'll quickly read this one out for you. All of these, by the way, are dermologically tested, which... That is exactly what you're looking for. So yes, I am going to use this one. This one has so many goodness in it and it's honestly so simple. You literally pop it on your face, leave it on for 50 minutes and wash it off. Like it is literally perfect. Um, but do you know what I didn't realise about Cubella? Um, that means water beauty in Italian. Well, if it means putting a face mask on means I'm an absolute stunner, then count me in, guys. So yeah, I'm going to pop this one on um, and then I'm going to wash it off, go for a shower and then go to the gym um, and kind of get like a wee exercise done and then go to a food shop and then today I'm going to just kind of have a wee, I'm not really doing anything exciting guys, it's kind of like a, just a wee day in the house um, but I mean, what else is there to do? We're actually still in lockdown um, and I'm going to, I've got loads of packages I want to unbox, I'm going to do that as well um, and then I'm going to get this fake tan off, I'm going to put new fake tan on um, I'm going to show you my lunch today, what I'm having for lunch um, I forgot, eh, well I've not had breakfast yet, I could probably show you my breakfast depends how much time I've got, I might do breakfast, I'll take a wee walk with the dogs and yeah, we'll have dinner, I'm actually really excited for dinner tonight I'm making turkey chilli but I'm going to pop this on. Now, guys, what I actually like about Cubella is they are so affordable. These wee face masks are not expensive. Like, I've seen face masks before and I'm like, why would I pay that just to pop, literally wash it off 15 minutes later? Um, they're so affordable. You can also get them on Amazon. Um, and they actually have a vegan friendly range as well. And the vegan friendly range is amazing. Like, there's so many things to choose from, which I also love. And I'll just show you other ones. Like, there's so much to choose from. Like, in my little box here. I honestly have so many, I absolutely love it. Like, look at this one, the pomegranate one. That one looks absolutely amazing. Then you've got the hemp and coconut. And I think the hemp is really good for like calming you down and it's just really relaxing and soothing. Um, and then this one, this is what you want to put on when you wake up in the morning. This is like a, um, an antioxidant citrus peel off max with lemon and orange oils and sodium halonate. Brightens and hydrates. And maybe I should be putting that on instead of the avocado one. And then see these ones, the big ones that you get. It's like the vitamin glow. And they're like pure glittery on your skin. I absolutely love that. So what I'll do guys is I'll make sure to link them below. Um, if you have any questions of that or whatever, then you're more than welcome to ask me. Um, and I'll pop up like a wee um, link on my Instagram as well in case you want to head over to there. But I'm going to just pop this right on my dial. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm just going to get my camera up and use that as a wee mirror. And he's going to be well ready when he comes back to walk for the dogs and finds out I'm sitting here with a face mask on. Look at the colour of this one, guys. 
Let me see. I just don't know what it is, guys. There is something about a face mask that just makes you happy. And I'm unsure what it is, but I am all for it. Sorry, I'm just using my... Oh, guys, this just smells of happiness. This just makes me, honestly, beyond excited about booking to go for a massage somewhere as soon as, obviously, you are allowed. I always make sure I pack a lot of this on my nose because I feel like that's where I kind of get a lot of my, like, my breakouts or... I tend to have more of like a clog of like not so goodness. It's like what's that? I'm trying to say my skin. Like I feel like I always get like kind of like, pores, problems, and stuff like that on my nose. I can hear somebody at that bedroom door. Someone's trying to come in here. Oh my god! And the good thing is, guys, I put this avocado one in the fridge this morning. Oh my god! It's absolutely buying. I think I can hear Lee outside. What oh, is there? We face mask so you get one later. What? Get me face mask <laughs> later. <coughs> you <right? coughs> so yeah, this is how oh, sexy oh. Get out. I look with a face mask oh, on. Oh. Anyone else just think when you put a face mask on it just reminds you of Mrs. Doubtfire when she puts oh. her face in that cream pie. That's exactly it's dripping from my chin and all that. It's just how I think I look. But yeah, I'm gonna go and we're gonna go chill and we've got on some calm music and we're gonna relax the shit out of this day. guys I've sat with the mask on for like 15 minutes now so I'm gonna go for a shower but I'm debating whether or not I want to wash my hair I don't know if I can be bored we'll soon find out but I'm gonna go wash this off in the shower and then yeah you can come out and see my absolutely stunning skin afterwards so guys that's us back from doing the big massive shop I honestly never ever ever enjoy that shop but we need to put away all these dishes and then we need to put away all the food but I could do a wee run through of some of the stuff we got but we're absolutely starving because I've been to the gym obviously and had no food so usually I would have ate by now but I will set you guys up somewhere. Yes you can. I'll need to show you later on the night guys the lights. I haven't showed everybody the lights. I need to show you the lights. We got lights in our stair and our kitchen, and it just changes everything. It's so so nice. Do you want to start putting away the dishes, and I'll start putting away the food? Do you want me to just cook breakfast first, then put away the food, or he's no, getting, getting his knickers in a twist because it's possibly going to be in the YouTube. You know he's absolutely choking to be in it. Um, oh, well, there's an assumption video got by the way, guys. Lee's going to ask more questions. Hopefully, he's letting me read this time, but we'll find it soon. Do you want me to do? Do you want me to make breakfast then put away the food? Yeah, I'll start doing that if you... Will you start doing dishes, mate? So guys, see if you're trying to eat kind of relatively healthy. These are really good. These are reduced fat bacons. This is what me and Lee eat now. It's like our bacon. Um, and then after's doing this new thing, it's like... um, They like organise. They kind of like prep all for you, basically. So for one dinner this week, we're going to have the beef chilli with noodles and veg. It's like a stir fry. I'll show you that, so we've got two of them because I need two for Lee for lunch. And then I always have these and my chicken salad for lunch. And then I got these for dinner, the smoky chicken and chorizo kebabs. That look really good. And then the night for dinner we're having turkey bol um not turkey bolognese, what do you call that Lee turkey chilli? Yeah. <laughs> I'm having mine with cauliflower rice and Lee's having has my normal rice, but I'll show you as the day goes on, but I just thought I'd show you them because they're really good if you are trying to eat kind of relatively healthy. Coco! 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 Hi! Coco! I'm buzzing there. Yeah. Hi, 
am back guys. I, well, totally lost track of time. So I put, went for a shower, washed off my face mask, went to the gym, went and got a food shop, walked the dogs, I'm back. I went for another shower. Weird. Went for another shower and decided I wasn't going to wash my hair because I just put loads of oils in it because on Monday, obviously the hairdressers opened in Glasgow. Don't know if it's the same everywhere, but they opened in Glasgow. So I went and got my colour done. Um, I did keep a lot more brown. I wouldn't go as blonde as I'd usually go, but there was obviously bleach put on my hair. So you guys know I'm in this massive hair care journey. So I decided today because I'm going to take photos tomorrow, I will just have a little hair care, skin care, positive, let's fucking care about me day. And I literally have drowned my hair in oil. So that tomorrow when I wash it, stunning. I keep thinking that Hoover's someone in my camera lens and I keep shaking myself. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna leave my hair today it's soaked in these oils and then I'll wash it tomorrow for photos and stuff. But I've had my breakfast, I didn't film it, I totally forgot. Because I was making Lee's at the same time and he was rushing me because he had the gym and all that, I was a bit ugh, flapping. But I had my egg and bacon taco boats, which are so good. Um, I actually need to add all that in my fitness pal and yeah, now I'm going to go and make lunch and take you guys with me. Um, I'm in the mood for a wee chicken salad and then I have two bedrooms I need to tidy. Full of clothes, packages I need to open. So yeah, we'll just do it together. You can open packages with me. We can see what PR stuff I've got sent, what stuff I've maybe bought um, and then yeah, we can tidy the shit out of it because really it does stress me out when it's not tidy. So I'm going to just go and hammer that today and then I'm going to sort parcels for the post office and I'll probably take them back tomorrow. I don't think I've got time to do that today. But let's go make some lunch. So guys, I have got the air fryer on. I am just about to make some lunch. So for lunch today, it's just a, um, a chicken salad basically. I've got the air fryer on, that's what that really bad loud noise is. Um, I'm using this chicken for lunch today. I know it's not really the most appetizing, is it? And I'll show you our chicken like that, but sorry, gals. Right, I need to get my wee scales out. Ooh, smells Mexicana. Ooh. Right. You can't really see me, that's the only thing I'm sight of here. Is that better? Sorry, you're wobbling a wee bit. Let's see if you can stop wobbling. So, Oh, that's bang on. So I'm going to have um, 100 grams of this chicken, so I'm going to just put that in my fitness pal. I've still to add my breakfast, but I'll just quickly add um, my lunch. Does anyone else use my fitness pal? I do. Right, so I've added my chicken. So my wee air fryer, I'll turn you this way. Now it tells me to add it in. Done this the wrong way, guys. Guys, 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 I fucked it today. My god, I look ugly as hell. I am um, I bought a cooked chicken for this and I just didn't need that. Do you know what? Lee can have that chicken. I'll get that for Lee. So start again, guys, because just fucked it. Typical Abby. <coughs> Never seen the dating right. Story of my life, guys. Can you see me if I'm chopped with salad? So I use like a mix of lettuce. I use like normal lettuce. With this lettuce. And I also use <coughs> ice cream lettuce. Stunning. Then get my wee cucumber. I always buy a half cucumber, guys, because I never seem to actually use it. Can't really 
really see my salad, can you? But does anyone else, when um, the door go, pretend that the mum and dad own the house? Do you know what I mean? Like, see when people come round and try and sell you stuff, I always got that. Oh, okay, I'll ask my mum and dad, and then they go, oh, do you know I love you? And I go, yeah, no, I love you, but mum and dad don't, and they go, oh, okay, no bother. Some like that. I don't have the heart to tell you, know me, and I also, yeah, I still have the heart to say no. So I just pretend that mum and dad are in the house, and yeah, hope for the best. And they don't usually question it, so I really got a lot more cucumber. That chicken is sizzling away. The salad looks stunning, guys. Stunning. So that's that. That's the tomato. Now we just need some onion. Then guys, I always add little croutons, but usually I weigh them out, but I know I've worked it out. One, two, three, that's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That there is, um, that's um, ten grams. I'm going to try something different. I don't usually add olives to my salad, but I'm going to try them. I got these ones at Asda. Um, so it says 15 grams but contains 26 calories, so... Right, so there's 20 grams of... No, is that wrong or right? 9 grams, sorry. Of olives, pop them in. And then I just need to cook the chicken. Not cook the chicken. What do you call it? Cut the chicken. And then I started using like I know obviously probably Hellman's is like the pure the bees knees and all that, right? But I'm not gonna lie, guys, I got this, the Heinz's meal. So nice. Oh, oh. Salt and pepper and some reduced sugar sweet chilli. And there you have it guys, my banging little lunch. So I don't even know if you'll hear me because it's outside but I'm going to have my wee salad. I'm going to try one of my wee olives. Mm. My salad actually looks really good, guys. I probably need to shut that back door because I cut my grass. Yeah. I was watching Molly and Megan the other day, right? And they pure said something and I thought, wow, girls. Little smart cookies. And like, Sophia was like, not maybe not scared, but a lot, maybe like a little bit like, ugh, a bit saying about her nose job. Because obviously she has a platform and you don't want to look like you're promoting cosmetic work. But in the same aspect, she has had girls that have followed her from the minute they've done that and like I'm with um, you guys, I tell you about my insecurities and I think she's tried her hardest to love it or love the insecurity and she can't so she's waiting to go it fixed or changed and I just think like it's also good for her to show that and like say to girls like look I took a good couple of years, I thought about it it doesn't make me feel any better so I've went and done something about it. 
because like I think people might think oh she just jumped in but this is something that Sophia was saying she wanted for years like and I think as well like hard not be able to tell you guys because she's scared of people in her backlash like that's so sad like I, I mean I'm going to be honest I did not think she needed it but then everybody says that about it you know what I mean like people will tell me all the time I don't need mirrors pinned back you're just lying people tell me all the time I don't have fat arms you're just lying but yeah Molly and Megan were saying that like it's just sad sometimes that you're like so scared to upset everybody I'm like she should just be happy that she's done something she's worked hard to be able to afford to get it done she's thought about it for years so yeah I'm all for it I'm all for her making the right decision for herself guys I'm not gonna lie I really can't be fucked doing this but oh that's more eternal youth um, but yeah I'm gonna just open one I think are like important Guys, Eagle sent me a little um, package. Oh, oh, this is so sweet. Oh my god, guys, this is just came in the post. I know it's a little late for Easter. But oh my god. Hope that's still edible because I want to eat it. And then, oh my god, how stunning is this wee candle? Please excuse my nails and then those shoes. Guys, you know that I love an orange sandal, so this is right up my street. And then you've got the wee shampoo bar. Thank you so much, Eagle. And nice is that, like, guys, a little bit of pampas. And then you've got, like, a little marble candle. And we've got these absolute bad boys. Love them. Is this cookie in date? Could possibly be in date. Unsure. I think these will be in date. Date it. How cute is this can candle in the pamphlet? I absolutely love that. Um what else do I need to get through? What else can I show you? Oh my god guys, how is CV gifted me stuff? But I don't want to take it out of the box because I don't want to get it messy, but they have sent me stuff. This is fragile. Hello. So guys, a company called Willow. Hi Abby, we're so excited for you to decorate your beautiful home with our candles. Please tag us any photos you take. Oh. Oh my god, they smell unreal. I have so many body candles and um, I'm literally just waiting for my room to get done which is actually going to be happening next week. Um, how cute are they? Um, so yeah, all my candles are going to be put in actual place. I absolutely love that. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's more in there. I nearly binned it. Um, oh my god guys, look at this one. I think I've got this in the mini one, I do. Um, but look at that, little cloud. And then they've sent me um, that one as well. So thank you so much, I'll pop up the Instagram for this place. It's called Sage and Willow. Um, so that is so, so kind. And then also I've got my Eevee Eagle one. So I have like, the biggest collection of these candles is no joke. Like I will need to like figure out where I'm gonna put all these candles. Um Lee obviously keeps going to try and burn them and I'm like, hun, they are not for getting burnt for their decoration. Um, um I really can't be bored with any of these packages. Is that bad? Is that bad? Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it because it's getting quite late and I'm going to go do my fake tan, get my pyjamas on and make dinner so you can make dinner with me and we'll put tan on. Then we'll do my skincare, then we'll go to bed. That's what we're going to do. I actually cannot wait until it's like sandal season and we can wear shit like this and get our nails done and blow dries and a good life. I'm so fucking tired. 
for decorating our living room and oh my god it's so stressful because we just realised that where we're going to put the telly because we're changing the whole layout we might need to get sky out and if we need to get sky out I will fucking not be happy because sky take weeks to come and someone just said I might need to rip up my carpet and I'm like don't have time for that don't have time for that mainly on Saturday we're going to go to B&Q and we're going to pick a paint because we need to get paint for the feature wall paint the living room and paint for the rest of the gaff um because the house is just too white it's just white and me in white don't go well together um but yeah how stunning is this wee bit of pampas grass absolutely love that but yeah i'm going to be doing like a youtube room um transformation living room, room living room transformation and then the bedroom's getting done in may and i'll do a wee video on transformation on that but this room's going to get done next week so i will make sure to get all that filmed and ready and cute and lovely and stunning so yeah do I work to my tan before or after dinner? I think before yeah let's go do fake tan before so guys I'm going to put my fake tan on I need to fix my hair um, this little body lotion thing has burst all over the place I'm not unsure if you can see the fact I don't have pants on but hey -oh. but yeah let's go do some fake tan and pajamas on so i've got my fake tan on guys um please excuse the state of my pajamas but i think i wear like the oldest and ugliest you coming down coco the old and ugliest pajamas possible because obviously fake tan just genuinely stains everything my lips are really really like cut can you see that They're really chapped i don't know why that is I've also got a burn on my hip, like, like as if I like, actually burnt myself with like, hot, something like hot. Um, fuck knows what, I'll show you there. It's really sore. It was when I put fake tan on, I was like, what the fuck's that? I'll show you. Can you see it there? It's like a burn. I think Lee's tried to burn me in my sleep, if I'm honest. some lip balm because my lips are chapped but where can I sit you that you is that position I know you're on a little bit of a slant but what you do this is my La Mer lip balm oh my god it's game changing I don't want to actually yeah. I'm gonna go show Lee my burn Lee I've got a bad burn in my hat should I do something to sleep doesn't care. Doesn't care that I have to go to hospital. Come on. Um, for dinner tonight, guys, we are making. Um, I wonder actually, could you go? It's not a good angle though. I just to go otherwise. Yes. So tonight for dinner, guys, we're making tur turkey. Ball? No, turkey chili. This is my lights. How cool are they? Pure bright, stunning. Um, so yeah, there's good cooking. Cooking. So usually I would put peppers in my chili, but the mayonnaise. So run it back, cocoa pot. So yeah, I didn't buy any peppers, so just need to go without but I've got like kidney beans, jalapenos, mushroom, onions so kind of like a bolognese really but tastes of chilli. Um, so I need the big daddy pot and I would just need to cook the chilli. I'm not having it with normal rice because I'm obviously trying to eat a calorie deficit and the normal rice just basically takes up um, too much calories for me so I'm having cauliflower rice um, but the good thing with the cauliflower rice I'll show you oh I hate this cupboard shite honestly guys when I see this cupboard is the bane of my fucking life it's the bane of my life 
anyway, um, I'm having this. This is a cauliflower rice I have. It's not the best. Don't love it. Wouldn't have it of choice. Um, but it's only... Let me just tell you. Four carbs. So, because I have that, I like to have one of the low calorie pitas. Um, and I just toast that. Um, with the chilli, basically. Um, so, yeah. Bang in one. And then, season things. I always see them make pepper. Quite a lot of that. Can you see me? Is it actually better if I put you there? Can you see me here? Put in the paper and then... This is not how I would usually make my chilli. I usually make chilli like a sauce, but obviously again, sauces really contain a lot of calories. So I'm just going to go in and try and make my own just to like... seasoning and water. As you can tell, I don't measure anything, I just wrap it in. So obviously totally up to you what seasoning you like guys, but I really like my food mega spicy, so hence why I add like chilli flakes, paprika, all of the above. And I know if anyone's a chef and they're watching this, they're going to come for me, but I don't care. I'm actually some cook guys, I'm not even just saying that, but everyone who eats my cooking says it's really good, so I'm also doing something right. Unsure what, because nothing I ever make like from a recipe, it's just bang it all in a pan and let's hope for the best. But Lee Allen likes it, so if Lee Allen likes it, then that's all that matters. This is the one that's eating it. Right, I'm just going to just let that sit and then I am going to cut up. Um, my onion and my mushroom. Here. But I don't like my mushroom and neither does Lee like big and chunky. Like big bits of mushroom. I've just only started eating mushroom I'd say in the last year. I used to freak out when Lee's mum used to put hundreds of mushroom in the bolognese. But to be honest I've kind of grew up sometimes so it's just um me and Lee don't like it big and chunky. Like it nice and small. Mushroom. Right, so mushroom. I'll just finish that because it's not enough like, for another portion of it. I do have my nice big brown you can chop more by the way guys, but this one has just been washed so I guess I'll just add that. Add the mushroom. So guys I'm just going to some chilli con carne mix. I'm not really sure how much but it says per quarter pack. Let's just do that much. So guys it's not how I would usually make my chilli because like I usually mine with a sauce, but I'm just going to try and hope that it's tasty. I would like it a little bit more thick. It's a bit watery for me, so I'm going to just leave it sitting, simmering in the way. I have the sour cream, just to go a little dob on top. I've got my pita, and then I've got my cauliflower rice. Um, but yeah, hopefully it's banging. Also, I didn't cut my onions very good. They're quite big and chunky, but it's just really can't be thought. So, and also my camera dies, so I'm now filming on my phone. But hey ho. And there we go guys, so this is mine, this is a cauliflower rice, I've added extra jalapenos and then we've got the wee pitas and then this is Lee's and we've got the weighed out sour cream as well, so I'm quite chuffed, it looks quite good. Mine looks in see, but healthy lifestyle, I just love it.
finished dinner. I am stuffed and my lips are, oh, sorry. My lips are on fire. Can you see them? Bright pink. Um, so I'm gonna go and get some lip balm on them. I don't understand why they're like this. I was trying to think if I'd maybe like share the juice with someone or, and it's, I mean, it's cold in Glasgow, but it's been colder. So sometimes I get that if my lips are super cold, but yeah. I was a fat greedy bitch and tried to eat my chilli and burnt it through my mouth. It's really sore. Um, but I'm just waiting for my phone to charge and I'm going to edit this wee video. So it's going to be tomorrow for you guys. So happy Thursday. Um, and I have two face masks in the fridge and mainly I'm going to put one on before bed. I'm going to just put on a peel off one. Um, I think I think we're going to change it up because today was obviously one of the clay ones. But yeah, I am so tired these days guys, like no joke. I am lucky if I'm awake by 10 o'clock at night. Like I've been going to bed at like half nine every night. Just super, super tired. But yeah, there's nothing really else exciting. Sorry this video hasn't been the best. I must admit, this is probably one of my least good videos, so my shittest videos. But today I didn't leave, I did leave the house to walk the dogs, but I didn't do anything exciting. And yeah, that was really it. I just thought I'd show you a little bit of my day. It's not a long one. Um, but guys, this week and next week, we have very good videos coming up. I think these are going to actually quite enjoy me as a person. Um, I think it's going to be like great, I'll be great work, great work ethic. Um, order with the person in front of me orders. Um, we'll be going up on Sunday. Um, and then the hauls next week, like the blazer one and the jeans one and the assumptions video will all be next week. And then we'll do another wee vlog. And yeah, might even do a wee, another wee sushi mukbang. But yeah, that is basically it. There's gonna be loads. Um, as you guys know, I wasn't really feeling my best and it was showing, so there was a wee bit of a delay in videos. Um, and we are still in lockdown. I know obviously you can have people outside and stuff in your garden and you can go out and meet people outside and stuff like that, but obviously today was just like a during the weekday. It was like a, nowhere was open. Um, but yeah, can't really think of what else, but I think that's it. Is that it? Is that it? I'm unsure. I'm very unsure. But I think it is it. So I'm going to go, I'm going to go get lip balm on my lips. I'm going to go put on a wee face mask and I'm going to chill the fuck out. Um, the fake tan always looks shocking. I'm actually buying a new one. I know but I might get asked this. It's a um, fake bake. Um, I don't know what one it is. One is again fake bake. It's the one that comes in a spray bottle. Um, that is the only thing I'm a bit like. Oh, come on, fake bake, get with the mousses. But I just thought I'd try it because apparently, um, some of my sensitive skin I know used it, and I thought, well, okay, let me retry. Um, because as the years have went on, guys, a lot of things have changed. Like a lot of my allergies have changed. I'm still allergic to fake tan, um, and a lot of them. But there has been a few where I can wear it a few times before it starts nipping. So yeah, that's what this is. I have put it on. I'm unsure what that burn is on my heart, my hip. It's quite concerning. I'm actually like, what could have possibly have caused that burn? It's such a weird place because I never have that bit in my body. It's not as if I'm like, I mean, that's like, I would have to have wore brown pants. I'm so confused at what has burned that. Really, I am. Hmm. Um, but Lee is going to watch football and I'm going to edit a new video and yeah I'll see you guys for the next video and yeah please comment below that anything you'd want me to post like any other videos I'd love to do some more some fun ones um, Coco's currently in my shower so I've got to go so as always guys thank you for watching I love you all so much and I hope everyone is safe and we are one step closer to getting out and socialising and seeing each other again and hugging each other again. Can't wait to hug everyone. Like you see, I'm quite a huggy person. See, meeting people and not being able to give them a hug really bothers me. Obviously I understand why, but you want to come say bye, Coco? Come on then. 
So from me and little Coco Pop. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh. That's probably why I've got sore lips coming out and hard kissing. But from us, we love you lots and we'll see you in the next video.